So welcome, welcome, welcome everyone. Um, it's such a pleasure to be here with you. Um, we're in the midst of a global pandemic. I'm in Thailand at Vikasa, at this beautiful, beautiful place. And because of the situation in the world, we're here alone, um, which is fine too. But thanks to technology and internet and our online YTT, we are also able to meet here together virtually. So it's a pleasure for me to have this class uh, with all of you guys. So thank you, thank you, thank you for um, showing up to this class and to yourself. Um, we're gonna breathe, move, feel on our mat, I promise. But before we, before we do that, I just, wanna, um, I just wanna talk a little bit about something. So usually I like to uh, begin my classes um, sharing something from the heart. So whatever is present in me, I like to bring forth to you. And um, what I've been thinking a lot about lately, especially in terms of this class and the online YTT we are running at the moment, is the idea of being true and being you, authenticity. Mm -hmm. So we're all here together on this journey towards becoming a teacher. Some of you, I know you're already a teacher, but you're doing this um, training as um, a bonus thing. Maybe you wanna you know, learn something new or just come back to yourself or have a, a YTT experience. Um, and when we're on this kind of journey, it's very easy to you know, wonder like, how should I be as a teacher? You're maybe looking at teacher A, teacher B, teacher C, and you're thinking, how do I do this? Maybe you're even thinking uh, back on yourself and looking at yourself and thinking, I cannot do this, I'm not there yet, or whatever it might be. Yoga is all about shedding layers and understanding what's inside. So coming back to center, coming back to core, coming back to essence, coming back to who you are. Mm -hmm. And teaching yoga is all about doing that and letting that be shared with the world. Mm -hmm. So there's not a right way of teaching. There's not a wrong way of teaching. There's not a right way of being or wrong way of being. It's all about becoming who you are and trusting that that is enough. Yeah, and that's maybe one of the toughest and more, most challenging things we can, we can do to really dive into this and see what's actually there and then to dare to share that with others, to trust that this is enough, this is, this is what I've got and in that I can just be exactly what I am. And I have this big, big, big belief that whatever we are practicing within these four corners of our mat, um, we can take with us outside the mat. So for me, it always starts here. That's why I today want to invite you to take that idea of uh, truth and becoming you, being you, authenticity with you in your practice because if you can as you're breathing moving feeling on your mat can embrace what's deep inside it's easier to take that from the mat out into the world as a teacher or just as a human being okay so let's begin i would like to start um, lying down on, on the mat. So just coming on to your, to your back body. Just take your time here to settle in. See what feels comfortable, maybe shifting the hips, shuffling the shoulders. 
either just letting the arms and hands be by your side. Maybe it feels good to place the hands somewhere on your body, belly, chest. We're beginning this class by just finding a way into relaxation. So see if you can let your body get heavy. Maybe it feels right to close down the eyes. Drawing the attention inside. Feeling the mat, the floor, the earth underneath you. And feeling the air, the space around you. Just knowing that right here, right now, it's all about you. Right here, right now, you have the permission to be exactly who you are. Right here, right now, there is nowhere else to be. Feeling into your body. Can you soften? Checking in with your mind. Can you allow those thoughts? Noticing your heart. What kind of emotions are present? Once again, can you let everything be exactly the way it is? And you embrace yourself. Together through the nose, take a deep breath in. And together through the mouth, sigh the air out. Again, deep inhale. Open the mouth and let it out. One more time, deep breath in. And open up, release. Closing the lips, deep inhale. Closing the lips. Long exhale. Deep breath in. Steady breath out. Feel the inhalation.
feel the exhalation. With each inhale, we expand. With each exhale, we let go. Take one more breath in. One more breath out. On your next inhalation, right leg up towards the ceiling. Exhale, place both of your hands behind your thigh and start to pull your leg in towards you, feeling the back of the leg opening. Moving the breath in, moving the breath out. And then beginning to rotate your ankle, moving the foot a couple of times towards one direction. And then a couple of times to the opposite direction. Still breathing. Take one more deep breath in, lift the leg higher. And exhale for half happy baby, right knee to the side, right hand around your right foot, pulling the knee down towards the floor. Maybe left hand land on your left hip, flexing your left foot. Deep breath in. Long breath out. Soft face, soft belly, deep inhale. Steady, exhale. Take one more deep breath in. And on your exhale, re-bend the knee. Pull the knee in towards your chest, one breath in. And on your exhale, twist your body, right knee to the left, right arm towards the sun. It may be turning your face towards the right. Starting very gently, starting very softly, no force, no effort, just letting the body land. Deep breath in. Long breath out. One more inhale. One more exhale. Inhale, come back to center, maybe squeezing the knee in. And exhale, release your right leg back to the floor. Inhale, left leg up towards the ceiling. Exhale, hands around your thigh, pulling the leg in. And then starting to move your foot, moving your ankle a couple of times towards one direction. Still breathing deeply. A couple of times to the opposite direction. One more inhale, lift the leg high. Exhale, half happy baby on the other side. Bend your knee, knee down to the floor. Left hand, left foot, right hand, maybe right hip, keeping the leg engaged by flexing the foot. Shoulder blades are soft. Deep breath in. Long breath out. Deep inhale. Steady exhale. Take one more deep breath in. And exhale, bring your left knee in towards your chest. Deep inhale, press the leg in. And exhale, twist, left knee to the right, left arm to the side, maybe turning the gaze in the same direction. And again, just softly arriving into the posture. Keep the body relaxed. Deep breath in. Long breath out. 
One more inhale. One more exhale. Inhale, coming back to center. This time, exhale both of your knees into your chest. Wrap your arms around your knees, giving yourself a nice, beautiful hug. Maybe rolling a little bit side to side to massage the spine. And when you're ready, hands around your thighs. A couple of times, rocking yourself back and forward. And eventually coming all the way up, crossing your legs, hands to the mat, stepping your feet back and arriving in all fours. Hands underneath your shoulders, knees in line with your hips. Together, deep breath in, start to drop your belly down, lift your tail, chest, chin. Exhale, round your spine, navel in, push the floor away. Again, deep breath in, drop belly, lift tail, chest, chin. Exhale, rounding, rounding, rounding. Inhale, drop the belly, lift the heart. Exhale, arching, arching, arching. Deep inhale, can you feel your body? Exhale, can you connect? Either staying right here, moving in your cats and cows, or starting to explore your body a little bit further, maybe moving side to side. Maybe finding some circles for the hips. Perhaps leaning forward, perhaps leaning back. See if you can close down your eyes and just feel whatever is there. What does your body long for? How can you move in a way where you are connected to yourself? What feels true to you right here, right now, in this moment? Can you let go of how it looks from the outside and just embrace what's on the inside? One more breath wherever you are. And then slowly coming back to center. Take one breath in. And as you exhale, tuck your toes, press back downward facing dog. Staying in our down dog and doing exactly the same here. Just moving the body in a way that feels authentic in a way that feels real. Maybe that means walking the feet side to side, bending the knees, moving the hips, maybe shaking the head, yes, 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 shaking the head, no, no, no. Maybe you need to shorten the stance, maybe lengthen. Do whatever feels right. And when you're ready, just arrive in stillness. Mm -hmm. Start to really spread your fingers wide. Push the floor away from you. See if you can soften your shoulders, soften your jaw. Is it possible to lengthen in your back body? Maybe by bending the knees slightly and lifting the heels off the floor. Find your posture. Together, let's take a deep breath in. Together, a long breath out. Again, deep inhale. Steady exhale. Take one more deep breath in. One more long breath out. Beautiful. Next inhalation, roll your body forward into plank, shoulders above your hands. Exhale, press back, downward facing dog. Again, inhale, rolling forward, find your plank. Exhale, push back, downward facing dog. One more time, inhale, rolling forward. This time, pause, stay, hold. Finding your plank position, 
anchoring the hands into the mat, pushing the floor away, doming your upper back, navel into the spine, engage your glutes, engage your legs, press the heels back, back, back. You can always drop your knees down if you need, otherwise stay as you are, starting to really feel that inner strength we're all carrying. Together, deep breath in. Together, long breath out. Nice. Take one more inhale. Shift slightly, slightly forward. And exhale, coming all the way down, landing on your belly. Point your toes, hands frame your rib cage. Inhale, cobra, pulling the hands back, chest up and forward. Exhale to release down to the floor. Again, inhale, lift the chest, roll your shoulders back. Exhale to release. Beautiful. Inhale, letting your breath guide you up, up, up. Exhale, let the breath take you back down two more times. Inhale, lift the chest. Exhale to release. Nice. One more breath in, lifting the chest up. Stay. Exhale, placing your hands behind your back, interlocking your fingers and lifting your legs up, starting to connect with the back side of our bodies. So from your heels to the back of your head, can you really feel how you're activating every single part? from the tips of your toes all the way up. Can you be connected? Together, deep breath in. Together, long breath out. One more inhale. Exhale, release down to the floor, hands underneath your shoulders, tuck your toes. Inhale, coming up to plank. And exhale, downward facing dog. Deep breath in, long breath out, deep inhale, steady exhale, take one more deep breath in, one more long breath out, next inhalation coming up onto your toes. Exhale, plant your heels back down to the earth. Again, inhale up onto the toes. Exhale, heels back down. Last one, inhale up onto the toes, stay. And from your tippy toes, walk towards the front of your mat. Take your time, no rush. Mm, coming to the front of your mat, letting your body fold forward, perhaps placing your hands on the opposite elbow and finding your ragdoll, just letting the crown of your head be heavy, letting your body move, sway side to side, bending as much as you need in your knees. Can you make this comfortable? Can you let everything soften? No tension in your face, no tension in your neck. Is it possible to release lips, teeth, tongue, jaw? Take one more breath in. And as you exhale, drop your hands either to the floor, fingertips to the shins. Inhale, halfway lift, roll the shoulders back. Exhale to release. Again, inhale, halfway lift, chest is open, broad. Exhale to release. One more, inhale, halfway lift, lengthen the spine. Exhale to release. On your next inhalation, slowly, gently, vertebra by vertebra, coming all the way up to standing. Arms reaching over and above your head, lengthen, lengthen, lengthen. And exhale, hands to heart center. 
We're gonna meet in our Tadasana in our mountain. So placing the feet either hip width apart or feet together, whatever works for you. Let your eyes close down and keeping the attention on the inside here. Directing your focus down towards your feet. Can you spread your toes wide? Can you ground your feet front, back, inside, outside? Really feeling connecting to the floor. Engaging your legs by squeezing the muscles around your bones. Start to tuck your tail gently. Lift your navel in, in, in and up, up, up. Shoulders are soft, roll back, chest is open, crown of your head is reaching towards the ceiling. Finding steadiness and ease. Finding our breath together, exhale all the air out empty. Inhale, belly, chest. Collarbones. Exhale all the air out, empty. Inhale, belly, chest, collarbone. Exhale all the air out. Inhale, two, three, four. Exhale, two, three, four. Inhale, two, three, four. Exhale, two, three, four. One more breath in. One more breath out. Opening up the eyes. Inhale, arms over and above your head, reaching up. Exhale, start to fold your body forward. Inhale, halfway lift, lengthen. Exhale, step, walk or jump back, lower down, chaturanga, belly, bend your elbows. Inhale, upward facing dog or cobra. Exhale, downward facing dog. Stay, breathe, feel. Hands are anchored into the mat. Can you start to rotate your forearms slightly, slightly in and the same time as you rotate your upper arms slightly, slightly out. Shoulders away from your ears. Create space in between your shoulder blades. Lift your sit bones high, high, high. And feel that sensation in the back of your body. Right here, right now, how present can you be in yourself, with yourself? Together, deep breath in. Together, long breath out. Next inhalation, up onto your toes. Exhale, bend your knees, look forward, step, walk or jump towards the front of your mat. Inhale, lift heart. Exhale to fold. Inhale, coming all the way up, reach your arms up. Exhale, hands to heart center. Again, inhale, reach all the way up, lengthen. Exhale, fold forward. Inhale, lengthen the chest. Exhale, step, walk or jump back, lower down, chaturanga. Inhale, lift your heart. Exhale, downward facing dog. Stay. B, connect. How is the breath moving in your body? What is happening every time you inhale? What is happening every time you exhale? Where is it possible to create more space? And where in the body do you need to engage, activate, hold? Is it possible to find a balance where you are in this moment? Together, deep breath in. Together, long breath out. Inhale up onto your toes. 
Exhale, bend your knees, look forward, step walk or jump towards the front. Deep breath in, lengthen. Exhale, fold. Inhale, coming all the way up, reach your arms up. Exhale, hands to your heart center. One more sun, a deep breath in. Can you feel your body as you lift? Long breath out, letting go of whatever doesn't serve you. Inhale, offering your heart maybe gratitude. Exhale, step forward, jump back, lower down, chaturanga. Inhale, lift your chest, create space. Exhale, downward facing dog. Pause. Breathe. Moving prana, moving life force. Feeling each breath in. Feeling each breath out. In this moment, nowhere else to be. Nowhere else to go. Diving into yourself. Together, deep breath in. Together, long breath out. Inhale up onto your toes. Exhale, bend your knees, look forward, step, walk or jump. Inhale, lift heart. Exhale to fold. Inhale, coming all the way up, reach your arms up. Exhale, hands to heart center. Take one breath in. One breath out. We take it further. Next inhalation, sit down. Utkatasana, chair pose. Exhale, twist towards the right. Left elbow, right knee, hands together. Sitting low into your hips. Knees are in one line. Can you still feel both of your feet grounded, anchored into the mat? With each inhalation, we're finding more length in the upper body. And with each exhalation, we start to open, twist, rotate. Can you feel your chest? Can you feel your heart? Can you feel yourself? Are you still breathing deeply in and out throughout the nose? Together, deep breath in. Together, long breath out. Beautiful. Next inhalation, sit down. Utkatasana, arms reach out. Exhale, fold forward, Uttanasana. Inhale, lift your heart, lengthen. Exhale, step your left foot all the way back to the end of your mat. Drop your knee down to the floor. Inhale, lift both arms up, lower the hips open. Exhale, hands to the mat, right leg straight, flex your foot and fold. Again, inhale, drop the hips, reach your arms up, open. Exhale, hands to the floor, right leg straight, fold forward. Three more times. Inhale, Anjaniasana, reach up. Exhale, Ardha Hanumanasana, fold forward. Again, deep breath in. Can you feel your body? Long breath out. Can you be connected? Take one more inhale, reach up. One more exhale to fold. Inhale, coming back to center. Exhale, tuck your back toes, lift your left knee off the floor. Inhale, right leg towards the sky, lift up. Exhale, right knee, right elbow, come forward like a plank. Again, inhale, right leg to the sky, three-legged dog. Exhale, knee into the nose, curl the dome. Inhale, right leg to the sky, lift up. Exhale, right knee, left elbow, come forward. Again, inhale, leg up. Exhale, knee towards the right. Using your core, inhale, right leg up. Exhale, knee into the nose, round as much as you can. Inhale, right leg up. Exhale, to the left, twist. One more round, inhale, leg up. Exhale, right to right. Use the breath, inhale, leg up. Exhale, knee to nose. Inhale, leg up. Exhale, to the left. Beautiful. Inhale, right leg all the way up. Lift high. Exhale, step your right foot forward in between your hands. Take one breath in. Lift chest. 
Exhale, left foot, meet the right, we fold forward. Inhale, coming all the way up, reach up, reach up, reach up. Exhale, hands to heart center. Same thing, other side. Inhale, sit down, Utkatasana. Exhale, twist towards the left, right elbow, left knee. Beautiful. Feet are anchored, knees are in one line, hips are low. With each breath in, we're lengthening the back body. And with each breath out, opening up, twisting, turning, rotating. Staying with the breath, staying with yourself. Fully and completely present. Take one more deep breath in. One more long breath out. Nice. Next inhalation, sit back down. Utkatasana, arms reach up. Exhale, fold forward. Utanasana. Inhale, lift your chest. Exhale, step your right foot all the way back. This time, drop the knee. You know this now. Inhale, arms up, hips down. Exhale, hands to the floor. Left leg straight, flex your foot and fold. Again, inhale, reach up, lower the hips. Exhale, hands to the mat, stretch out. Beautiful, three more times. Inhale, arms reach up, Anjani Asana. Exhale, fold forward. Beautiful, inhale, arms reach up, can you feel? Exhale, connect. One more time, inhale, arms reach up. Exhale, fold forward. Great, inhale, coming back to center. Exhale, tuck your back toe, lift your knee off the floor. Inhale, left leg up, three-legged dog. Exhale, left knee, left elbow, come forward, plank. Inhale, leg up to the sky. Exhale, knee into the nose, round. Inhale, leg up. Exhale, left knee, right elbow, twist. Inhale, leg up. Exhale, left knee, left elbow, forward. Inhale, leg up. Exhale, knee into the nose, belly in. Inhale, leg up. Exhale, to the right, twist, twist, twist. Inhale, leg up, one more round. You're stronger than you think. Exhale, left to left. Inhale, leg up. Exhale, knee into the nose. Inhale, leg up. Exhale, to the right, twist. Inhale, leg up. Exhale, step your left foot all the way in between your hands. Take one breath in to lift the chest. Exhale, right foot meet the left. We fold forward. Inhale, coming all the way up, reach your arms up. And exhale, hands to heart center. One breath in. One breath out. We take it either for, even further. Next inhalation, sit down, Utkatasana. This time directly exhale, Uttanasana. Inhale, lift your heart, lengthen. Exhale, step, walk or jump back, lower down, Chaturanga. Inhale, lift up, dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Take one deep breath in. One long breath out. Next inhalation, right leg to the sky, lift up. Exhale, right knee, right elbow, come forward, plank. Inhale, right leg to the sky. Exhale, knee into the nose, squeeze. Inhale, right leg to the sky. Exhale, twist. Inhale, right leg all the way up. Exhale, step your right foot in between your hands. Breath in, high lounge, arms reach up. Breath out to anchor. Find your lunge. Front knees bent, back leg is straight, hips are facing forward. Can you move your attention in towards your right foot and really press the heel down, down, down and pulling the heel back, back, back in towards the midline. Using the right leg, right glute. 
in the same time, keep lifting your left knee off the floor, up towards the ceiling, and pressing the left heel back, back, back. Tuck the tail slightly, move your navel into the spine, reach your arms even higher. Can you soften your shoulders? Can the chest stay open? Are you feeling yourself fully? Together, deep breath in. Together, long breath out. Nice. Take one more deep breath in. Exhale, opening up, warrior two arms out to the sides. Left foot is anchored. Front knee still bent, back leg still straight. Hips facing to the side, arms are reaching out. Shoulders are relaxed, facial muscles without any effort. Breath is traveling in, breath is traveling out. With each inhalation, can you find more length, like you're lifting the crown of your head up? With each exhalation, can you dive a little bit deeper? Together, deep breath in. Together, long breath out. Yes, inhale, reverse your warrior, stay low in the legs. Exhale, both of your hands down to the mat. Inhale, right leg to the sky. Keep the leg where it is. Exhale, chaturanga with the leg lifted. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Other side, same thing. Inhale, left leg to the sky. Exhale, left knee, left elbow. Inhale, leg up. Exhale, knee into the nose. Inhale, leg up. Exhale, to the right. Inhale, leg up. Exhale, left foot in between your hands. Deep breath in, arms reach up. Exhale, find your lunge. Again, front knee bent, back leg straight. And moving your awareness to your left foot this time, can you anchor the heel down, 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 and start to pull the heel in towards the midline. Moving your right hip forward, lifting your right knee up towards the ceiling. Keep pressing the right heel back, back, back. Moving breath in. Moving breath out. Can you find authenticity in your own practice as you are right here, right now on your mat? Together, deep breath in. Together, long breath out. Take one more inhale. Exhale, opening up, warrior two. Front knee bent, back leg straight, strong, active. Anchoring both of your feet down into the mat and pull the feet in towards each other energetically. With each inhale, lift the body up. With each exhale, ground further down. Feel your body from the inside out. Using breath using focus, using yourself. So good, together deep breath in, together long breath out. Next inhalation, reverse your warrior, stay low. Exhale, both of your hands down into the mat, inhale, left leg all the way up. Exhale, chaturanga, one leg lifted. In le inhale, arc, lift the chest. Exhale, downward facing dog, nice. Inhale, shift your weight forward, coming into a plank. Exhale, push back, downward facing dog. We did this in the beginning. Inhale, rolling forward into plank. Exhale, press back, down dog. Last one, inhale, roll forward into plank. This time, exhale, chaturanga. Inhale, lift the chest. Exhale, downward facing dog. Beautiful. Through the nose, take one breath in. And through the mouth, sigh it out. Inhale, up onto your toes. 
Exhale, bend your knees, look forward, step, walk or jump. Inhale, lift the heart. Exhale to fold. Bend your knees, inhale, sit down, Utkatasana, chair. Exhale, stand tall, Tadasana, hands to heart, eyes closed. A moment to pause. A moment to notice. What happens when you start to move your body? Can you feel your right side? Can you feel your left side? How does it feel when you breathe deeply? Is your mind wandering or are you fully, fully present with this moment? Can you feel yourself fully? Together, deep breath in. Together, long breath out. One more inhale. One more exhale. We keep flowing. Next inhalation, sit down, Utkatasana, arms up. Exhale, fold forward, Uttanasana. Inhale, lift the heart. Exhale, step, walk or jump back, lower down, Chaturanga. Inhale, up dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Take one breath in, one breath out. Inhale, right leg to the sky. Exhale, right knee, right elbow, feel the core. Inhale, legos up. Exhale, knee to nose, squeeze it in. Inhale, right leg up. Exhale to the left, twist. Inhale, right leg up. Exhale, step your right foot forward in between your hands. Inhale, arms goes up. Exhale, warrior two. Inhale to reverse. This time, exhale either right elbow to knee or right hand to the floor. Inhale, left arm over and above your head, stay here. Or exhale, find a bind, left arm down behind you. Reach your right arm up. Place your right hand around your left wrist. Find your position. Front knee bend, back leg straight, strong, active. Pressing both of your feet into the mat. Lengthen the side of your body from your left foot all the way to the crown of your head, maybe all the way to the tips of your fingers. With each breath in, we're feeling up, expanding. With each breath out, we're opening up, connecting. Feeling the breath, feeling your body. Breath by breath, moment by moment. Together, deep breath in. Together, long breath out. So nice. Inhale, reverse your warrior, stay low. Exhale, both of your hands down to the mat. Inhale, right leg to the sky. Exhale, chaturanga. Inhale, lift your heart. Exhale, downward facing dog, right to the other side. Inhale, left leg to the sky. Exhale, left knee, left elbow. Inhale, leg up. Exhale to the nose. Inhale, leg up. Exhale to the right. Inhale, left leg all the way up. Exhale, step your left foot forward in between your hands. Breath in, come up. Breath out, warrior two. Inhale to reverse. Exhale, either left elbow to the Knee or hand down to the mat. Inhale, reach your right arm over and above your head, lengthen. Stay there or exhale, right arm behind you. Left hand around your right wrist, find a bind. Both of your legs are strong. Again, coming back to that sensation of squeezing the muscles around the bones. Can you extend the side of your body, create space 
in every single cell. What happens if you turn your right shoulder a little bit more towards the right, left shoulder a little bit more forward? Is your chest still open? Are you still breathing deeply? Together, deep breath in. Together, long breath out. Next inhalation, reverse your warrior. Stay low, open up. Exhale, both of your hands down to the mat. Inhale, left leg to the sky. Exhale, chaturanga. Inhale, lift the heart. Exhale, downward facing dog. Directly inhale, roll forward, plank. Exhale, push back, downward facing dog. Again, inhale, roll forward, plank. Exhale, back to down dog. One more, inhale, roll forward, pause. Exhale, chaturanga. Inhale, lift the chest. Exhale, downward facing dog. Beautiful. Through the nose, one breath in. And through the mouth, one breath out. <sighs> Inhale up onto your toes. Exhale, bend your knees, look forward, step, walk, or jump. Inhale, lift heart. Exhale, fold. Bend your knees. Inhale, sit down. Utkatasana. Exhale, hands to the heart center, Tadasana, eyes closed. See if it's possible to be in complete stillness. No need to fix your clothes. No need to touch your hair. No need to Remove any sweat from your face. Just landing in your body. Landing in yourself. What does it mean to be authentic for you? Together, deep breath in. Together, long breath out. Deep inhale. Steady exhale. Last flow. Inhale, sit down, Utkatasana, arms up. Exhale, fold forward, Uttanasana. Inhale, lift your heart. Exhale, step, walk or jump back, lower down, Chaturanga. Inhale, lift chest. Exhale, downward facing dog. Taking one breath in. One breath out. Inhale, right leg to the sky, you know this now. Exhale, right knee, right elbow. Inhale, leg to the sky. Exhale, knee into the nose. Inhale, leg to the sky. Exhale, to the left. Inhale, leg to the sky. Ex exhale, step all the way forward. Inhale, high lunge. Exhale, warrior two. Inhale, reverse, listen to the change. Exhale, skandhasana, back of the mat. Bend your right knee, sit down. Bend your left knee, sit down. So sorry, back of the mat. I'm too used to mirror this for you. Maybe keeping your hands to your heart. Maybe left hand to the mat. Inhale, right arm to the sky. Maybe you find a little bind. Maybe right hand around your Left foot reaching your left arm over and above your head, grabbing onto the foot and extending the side of your body again. Whatever feels right for you. Deep breath in. Long breath out. 
deep inhale, steady exhale. If you're not already there, coming back to center, hands to heart, one breath in. Exhale, turn to the back of your mat, turning your body around. Inhale, arms over and above your head, high lunge. Exhale, arrowhead arms by your side. Inhale, lengthen, shift your weight slightly forward. And exhale, lift your right leg off the floor, warrior three. You can keep your arms either by your side, hands to heart, or reach your arms forward, whatever works for you. Keep grounding your left foot into the mat, keep lifting your right leg high. Bend your left knee slightly, spin your right hip down. Crown of your head reaching forward, forward, forward. Breath is moving in and out. Together, deep breath in. Together, long breath out. So nice. Next inhalation, right knee into the chest, arms reach up, up, up. We find our stork. Exhale, left hand to left hip, right hand either to the knee or peace fingers to big toe. Take one breath in. Exhale, start to extend your leg, if you like, forward. If you're holding in your big toe, if your leg is extended, see if you can move your shoulder, right shoulder back. Keep lifting the chest up. Feeling your body, feeling your breath, feeling yourself as you are. If you're struggling with balance, can you let yourself fall and then come back up? Maybe even smiling as you do. Take one more deep breath in, lift the leg high. Exhale, opening up the knee or the leg out to the side. Maybe left arm towards the side, maybe gaze following the hand right here, right now, no judgment, no competition, no effort. One more breath in. Exhale, coming back to center. Keep your leg straight or knee bent. Inhale, both arms up. Exhale, half moon, left hand down, right leg, right arm up towards the sky. Beautiful. Keep pressing your left foot down. Keep lifting your right leg up. Open the chest. Open the hip. Using the breath to stay present. Take one more deep breath in. Exhale, land softly, gracefully, warrior two. Inhale, straighten out both legs, heels in, toes out. One time, exhale, sit down, goddess. Inhale, coming all the way up, straight legs. Exhale, warrior two, facing the front. Inhale, reverse your warrior, listen for the change. Exhale, left hand down into the mat. Inhale, right arm reaching up, easy twist. Option one, staying here. Option two, place your right foot on top of your left foot, moving to the side, finding your side plank. Option three, peace fingers around your big toe, leaning to the side in your left foot and lift your right leg all the way up, finding Vashistasana. Wherever you are, be there fully. One more breath in. Exhale, coming back, plank. Take one, inhale. Exhale, lower down, chaturanga. Inhale, lift your heart up, dog. Exhale, downward facing, dog. Same thing, other side. Inhale, left leg up. Exhale, left knee, left elbow. Inhale, leg up. Exhale, knee into the nose. Inhale, leg up. Exhale to the right. Inhale, leg up. Exhale, stepping forward. Inhale, high lunge. Exhale, warrior two. Inhale, reverse. Exhale, skandasana, right knee bent. Left leg straight, hands into the heart. Mm -hmm. 
We're at the back of the mat. Maybe right hand to the mat. Inhale, left arm to the ceiling. Maybe you find a bind behind you. Maybe left hand reaches for the right ankle and you're leaning your body over right hand to your left foot, creating more length in the side body. Wherever you are, be there fully. Wherever you are, use your breath. Deep inhale. Long exhale. If you have any other position, coming back to center, hands to heart, one breath in. And exhale, turn towards the back of the mat. Inhale, high lunge, arms reach up. Exhale, arrowhead arms by your side. Inhale to lengthen, move the weight into your right foot. Exhale, lift your left leg up. Mirror whatever you did on the other side with the arms, either by your side, hands to heart, or arms reaching forward. Whatever feels good. Right leg is strong, knees slightly bent. Can you tilt your left hip slightly, slightly down? Pressing your left leg to the back, right leg into the mat, crown of your head reaching forward. Together, deep breath in. Together, long breath out. Beautiful, inhale, come up to standing, left knee into the chest, it might be wobbly, that's fine. Exhale, right hand towards your right hip, left hand either to the knee or peace fingers to big toe. Take one breath in, lift chest, and exhale. If you like, extend the leg. If the leg is extended, again, pulling the, el the left shoulder back. Lift the crown of your head up towards the ceiling. Hmm. Wherever you are in the world, can you feel the presence from every single person doing exactly the same as you are doing right here, right now. One more inhale. Exhale, opening the leg to the side, feeling the hips, maybe right arm towards the right, maybe gaze following that hand. Hmm. Take one more deep breath in. Exhale, coming back to center. Keep the leg where it is. Inhale, both arms up. Exhale, half moon, right hand down, left leg up, up, up. Opening the chest, opening the hip. Feeling, feeling, feeling. Take one more breath in. Exhale, land softly, gently, warrior two. Inhale, straighten out both legs, heels in, toes out, arms up. Exhale into God as one time. Inhale, coming all the way up, straighten. Exhale, warrior two, opening up. Inhale to reverse. Exhale, right hand all the way down. Inhale, left arm to the ceiling, easy twist. Either you stay there or left foot on top of the right, find your side plank or peace fingers to your big toe lifting the leg all the way up as you're rolling onto the side of your foot for full Vashistasana. Wherever you are, be there. Nice, one more breath in. Exhale, land your left foot down, left hand down plank. Take one breath in. Exhale, lower down Chaturanga. Inhale, lift the heart. Exhale, downward facing dog. Last little flow. Inhale, roll forward, plank. Exhale, push back down, dog. Inhale, roll forward, plank. Exhale, push back down, dog. Inhale, roll forward, plank. Exhale, chaturanga. Inhale, lift your heart. Exhale, downward facing dog. Through the nose, one breath in. And through the mouth, let it go. 
Inhale up onto your toes. Exhale, bend your knees, look forward, step, walk or jump. Inhale, lift heart. Exhale, fold forward. Sit down, inhale, Utkatasana, arms up. Exhale, hands to heart, Tadasana, close down your eyes. Is it possible to feel the beat of your heart? Is it possible to feel the vibrations inside? Is it possible to connect with everything you are? Physically, mentally, emotionally, perhaps even spiritually. How would your life look if you would move from a space of truth? Together, deep breath in. Together, long breath out. One more inhale. One more exhale. Slowing down our practice. Inhale, both arms up, lengthen. Exhale, fold your body forward. Inhale, lift your heart. And as you exhale, walking your feet out to the side, sitting down into a squat. Hands towards your heart center, elbows on the inside of your knees. Letting your hips be heavy, letting your heart be open, crown of your head reaching up. Feeling the breath entering. Feeling the breath leaving. Either you stay right here, perfectly fine, or if you want to play with one more arm balance, place your hands into the mat, elbows somewhere in between your armpits and elbows, knees somewhere in between your armpits and elbows, maybe lifting one foot, maybe two feet off the floor, finding your bakasana, your crow pose. Wherever you are, take one more deep breath in. And as you exhale, step walk or jump back to Chaturanga. Inhale, lift your heart. Exhale, downward facing dog. One breath in. One breath out. Inhale, right leg to the sky. Exhale, step your right foot in between your hands. Drop your left knee. Inhale, Anjaniasana, arms reach up. Stay here, exhale, bend your left leg, reach your arms back. Catch your foot and pull your heel towards your hips. Keep opening the chest, keep rolling the shoulders back, feeling the front side of your left thigh. Still moving breath prana, life force. Take one more breath in, one more breath out. Beautiful, release, inhale, come back, Anjaniasana, arms reach up. Exhale, Ardha Hanumanasana, just like we did in the beginning, flex your foot and fold your upper body forward. Either you stay there or start to walk your right foot a little bit further forward, left leg a little bit further back. Maybe staying right there, pressing the right heel down. 
maybe coming down into a full Hanumanasana, full split. If you're finding your full split, remembering keeping your hips facing forward. So turn your left hip forward, right hip back. Keep anchoring your right heel into the floor, pressing the heel down to engage the back of your leg, protecting from overstretching. Mm. Deep breath in. Long breath out. Beautiful. Inhale, pulling the leg back if it's not already there. Exhale, moving into pigeon, walking your right foot towards the left, right knee towards the right, hips still squared. Either stay in an upright position, perfectly fine, or take a deep breath in to lift the chest and exhale to lower down. And as you move into your pigeon, can you once again make a conscious decision to relax your body? Letting go of any tension, contraction, effort. See what happens when you stop resisting. And see what happens when you begin to embrace what's here. Embrace what's you. How does it feel when you can move on your mat from the center of your being, when you can move from your essence? And what happens when you take that with you outside your mat? Take one breath in. One breath out. On your next inhale, lift your chest, walk your hands back. Exhale to tuck your toes, move back downward facing dog. Straight to the other side, inhale, left leg up. Exhale, step your left foot forward in between your hands, drop your knee. Inhale for Anjaniyasana, either staying there or exhale, bend your right knee, place your hands around your foot, pull your heel in towards your hips. The chest, they open. Breath is calm. See if it's possible to stay in this moment. Doesn't matter what you've done, doesn't matter what's about to come, just right here, right now. Life is happening. Together, deep breath in. Together, long breath out. Release your foot if you have it. Inhale, Anjaniyasana, reach up. Exhale, Ardha Hanumanasana, shift your hips back, legs straight, fall forward. Either staying there or finding your way into split. Maybe just staying upright, perfectly fine, and coming all the way down. Mm. Again, if you have your split or if you're working towards it, keep pressing the right hip forward, left hip back, and keep engaging, protecting your left leg by pressing the left heel down, pulling the heel towards the midline. Hmm. Deep breath in. Long breath out. Take one more inhale. And then slowly exhale to come all the way back. Moving to your pigeon, left foot to the right, left knee towards the left. Moving your right leg back, hips are still squared, either staying right here upright or one breath in to lengthen. And one breath out, 
to fold forward. Hmm. And once again, soften the body. Soften your mind. Perhaps you can even soften your heart. Become a little bit more inviting, welcoming. As we do so with ourselves, we automatically do so with the world. But it always has to start right here. Together, deep breath in. Together, long breath out. On your next inhale, lifting your chest, walking your hands back. Exhale into downward facing dog. Last down dog for now. Take one deep breath in through the nose. And exhale through the mouth. Beautiful. Inhale up onto your toes. Exhale, bend your knees, look forward, step, walk, or jump through into a seated position. Placing both of your hands all the way back behind you. You can bend your knees, shifting your hips a little bit forward. And finding your rag pose, front side of your shoulders. Micro bend slightly in your elbows to protect joints, muscles. Soft breath. Soft body. Next inhalation, bring both of your knees in towards you. And exhale, move your way forward. Soles of your feet into the mat. Knees are bent, placing your hands on the sides of your rib cage. And then placing your elbows in between your knees, starting to squeeze your elbows together. Keep lengthening slightly in the spine. And just feeling into the back of the shoulders. Front side of the chest. Usually we talk about giving. And back of the chest. It's all about receiving. We're trying to open up the front as well as the back. I think one more breath in and exhale to release. Finding your way down onto the floor. So finishing right where we started, coming back with the back of your body towards the mat. Arms by the sides, grounding the feet down. And then inhale, start to lift your hips up. Moving into Satubandhasana, our, our bridge pose. If you like, you can interlock your fingers behind your back, walking your shoulders in. Maybe grabbing on to your ankles. You 
you can stay right here. We're going to hold one back bend today a little bit longer. So either staying right there or if you want to move into a full wheel, releasing your hands and placing them underneath your shoulders, coming up first on the crown of your head and then pressing all the way up. So either staying in your bridge or coming up into your wheel. Moving your breath into whatever part of your body needs it. Mm. Wherever you are, take one more breath in. And on your exhale, lowering down. Placing your feet wide apart, they can touch the edges of your mat, letting your knees drop in. Arms by your side, just a gentle, gentle internal rotation for the hips. Can feel really, really good after a back bend. Maybe staying in stillness or just moving the knees side to side. Releasing the spine slightly. Mm. Coming back to center, bringing both of your knees into your chest, wrapping your arms around. And this is a version of a forward fold. An easy, easy forward fold. Take one more breath in, one more breath out. Keep your knees where they are, cactus your arms out to the side, and then just drop your knees to the right for another gentle, gentle twist. Maybe turning your face towards the left. And of course, if you have any other version of a twist you feel like doing right now, you go ahead. Take one more breath in, one more breath out. Inhale, bring the knees back to center, and then exhale as you drop them to the left. One more inhale, one more exhale. Inhale, coming back to center, and exhale for a full happy baby, bringing both of your knees, knees out to the sides, hands around the outer edges of your feet, soles of your feet facing up towards the ceiling. Maybe moving a little bit side to side. From my own experience, I can tell you that's usually what babies, when they're happy, are doing. So why shouldn't we? Mm. Coming back to center, back to stillness. Bring the soles of your feet in towards each other. Let them touch. And then keeping them together as you place your feet down, knees out to the side, Supta Baddha Konasana. Placing your right hand on your lower belly, left hand on your heart, and letting your eyes, if they aren't already, close down.
what comes up for you when you breathe, move and feel on your mat. What happens when you start to peel off the layers that are covering, maybe protecting your essence? How does it feel to be you in this moment, right here, right now, in your body, on your mat, your own hands holding you? Do you feel connected? for the last time for now, through the nose, one breath in, and through the mouth, release. You can stay right here as long as you want. When it starts to feel right for you, to extend your legs and your arm. We're moving into our final, final, final position for this class. Making sure you're comfortable. Letting everything soften, everything relax, letting everything go. Nowhere to go. Nothing to do. And no one to be. Shavasana.
slowly. Start to deepen your breath. Wiggling your fingers. Wiggling your toes. Maybe reaching your arms over and above your head, giving your whole body a nice, long, deep stretch. And bringing your knees in towards your chest and once again, wrapping your arms around. One final, final squeeze. And then just leaning towards any side that feels comfortable. Taking a few breaths here. When you feel ready, finding your way up into a seated position. Keeping your eyes closed if possible. Placing your hands together in front of your heart. And taking a moment here to bring to mind one thing that you are grateful for. And from this phase of gratitude, thanking yourself for being here, for taking the time to arrive on your mat, to breathe, move, feel, connect, expand. Thanking the ones around you in this world for sharing this practice with you too. Namaste.